Hi and welcome to episode 1 of the Visual Connect series. In this, we try to understand the product, its value proposition and how it fits in the ecosystem. In today's episode, we try to understand host bus adapters and converged network adapters. Let us try drawing a normal ecosystem. In a normal setup, you have various systems. These systems connect to a LAN. Then there are various servers, different type of servers like application servers, database servers and your mail servers. These servers then connect to a storage area network. There are various switches. And these eventually connect to your storage arrays. These are basically large storage disk that offer storage. Now the value proposition of an adapter comes when a server wants to connect to your storage. This could either be a host bus adapter or a converged network adapter. The advantages of a HBA and CNA are IO processing. Today's HBAs offer 1 million IOPS per port. This is an advantage in today's server virtualization and consolidation environments as the HBA and CNA frees up your host to perform better IO processing. The second advantage is data buffering. With move to higher data rates, the uh, drives need for increased data buffering systems as this frees up the heavily loaded PCI buses. This offers better scalability and IO performance. The third advantage is virtualization. In port ID virtualization or NPIV is the term used to describe this. It is a fiber channel facility that allows multiple endport IDs to share a single physical endport. I hope this quick session was useful and it helped you understand the concept of HBAs better. Stay tuned for further episodes of the Visual Connect Server series. Thank you.